hello cooks welcome back to my channel thank you for coming through and watching this video and as you've already seen in the description today we're making a very simple and very delicious um chicken gizzards recipe i wanted to share this with you because i well this is one of the cheapest proteins you can buy ever in life <laughs> and it's so so simple and really delicious i grew up eating this um and so it has all these lovely memories attached to it i hope you try this recipe which you will find is absolutely simple but i think with this kind of thing you want to stick to simplicity and let me know what you think of the recipe and if you'd like me to try these more traditional dishes more on this channel let me know um by saying yay or nay in the comment section do give this video a thumbs up if you like it and please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't uh without wasting any more time let's get into this recipe chicken gizzards i'm adding a chicken spice or seasoning to them now then you just toss them through and make sure that they're all fully coated with the spice i didn't you know put too too much of it i just wanted to, i just want the gizzards to have some kind of seasoning before we go forward with the next steps next we add some oil to a pan i am using canola oil you can use any oil of your choice of course once hot i then add my gizzards in this pan what we're gonna do now is basically fry these just like this not having added anything you'll see that um after a few minutes of frying they start looking like they're stewing like this so they haven't gotten crispy or anything and this and there's actual um fluid from the gizzards but after longer um they actually do start frying and look at how crispy they are once that happens i add this onions and some garlic crushed garlic to that as well um looking so 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 crispy i'm very happy with this this is gonna actually make these taste so good at the end you'll see um just mix that through now and fry it some more for about two minutes um i've now reduced my heat to about medium for the step and after the two minutes um i keep using my lid as well guys even though we're still frying here now i'm adding um some curry powder this is my wet curry powder from food lovers market also adding the sweet paprika here now this is sweet basil dried sweet basil i love it and some salt as well just mix it through so while we're cooking um toasting the spices we're going to take um some flour and take the chicken spice we used earlier to just a little bit of it and then add some water as uh, about um a cup and a half of water with one tablespoon of flour and we're just gonna whisk this until you until it's completely smooth and you no longer see those flour bits on the top so whisk 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 and once it's ready we add it into our pot of gizzards and this will basically create our sauce this is basically us making our own soup powder it i love doing this because then i can control the flavor i don't like some of the flavors that come through from soup powders um so this is literally the best way to do it uh, thickens your sauce really well look at that um and this is exactly what i wanted i do want it to be a bit thicker though so i'll have it go a bit more 
note that right now my heat is on low because I don't want to burn this. Um, I just want to make sure that my sauce is created really well. Um, I did, I mean, my gills are stuck a little there, but that's not really a problem. Just lifting them off the bottom. And I am really, really happy with the look of this. Uh, a little taste and work done. So I served mine with some kale and bap on the side. Of course, you have the choice on what you end up serving. That's it, guys. We have come to the end of this video. Um, of course, we have to do the taste test. But this is how I am serving this baby girl with some up and some kale. <gasps> Doesn't this just remind you of a home? Anyway, of course I'm eating with my hands, child. Well, I'm just going to taste this because this is what this video is about. Look at that color. And this is the color we got from having fried this first. Mmm. It is so 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 delicious and this is how we eat it in South Africa of course mm. this meal right here is a thing of beauty so now that we've come to the end of this video please do not forget to subscribe to my channel please like this video and share it with your friends if you liked it so that we can get more views on it um but that's it for today thank you for watching and have a good one goodbye